Welcome to CEO Money. I'm Michael Yorba. Thanks for joining us. I have Claudine Wilder, president of Wilder Presentations, on the show with me today. Claudine, welcome to the show. Thank you. Glad you're here. All right, Claudine, tell our audience about your business. What is it? My business is basically to teach people to get to the message. Sooner rather than later, make a point and stop talking. That's basically what I do. Okay. And in your words, if you could tell us what you see are the major problems with presentations today. We all make them. Everybody has to make them in one form or another, but you're an expert in this. You know, what people think a presentation is about is delivery, but I believe they're wrong. What a presentation is about is really organizing your content in such a way that people understand what you're talking about. And what I see over and over again is maybe somebody's good talking, they can talk, they can pause, they can look, but they're disorganized. So after five minutes, you don't even know what their product's about or, or what they really want. Good point, good point. Um, are there any disruptor uh, disruptors in the presentation training? There are some different ways of looking at things. So what I did is I have an app, a presentation survey app, and I use that in my classes and with my clients. And it asks questions of an audience. Does the person really make an ask? Are you clear about their messages? And the most interesting thing I see of hundreds now of clients that I've worked with is that issues are really that people don't really make an ask Nobody knows what their messages really are, and they don't give time for people to ask questions. Claudine, what do you see as your company's role in the world of pre presentation training? I see my company's role as going into a company or working with an individual person and helping them understand, first, they have to have a message. They have to know what it is, maybe three messages. They have to know their objective. They have to know their ask. And once they put that together in what I call an executive summary, very simple and organized with key points, then they can practice presenting. Okay. You know, so I'm backwards. <laughs> I'm not so interested in how you speak or if you do uh, things like that at first. I'm more interested in what you've organized to speak about. What is Torch Metrics? Torch Metrics is this wonderful, innovative online tool that I made. For about 15 years, I've been giving my clients these Word documents, and they have to send those out to their colleagues and get feedback. And they get these papers, and they'd say, oh, they thought I was good at delivery, but I'm not organized. And I finally decided about three years ago to make an online survey. So what happens is someone gives the presenter feedback, and with each question, there are action steps for the person to get better. Because I don't think it's good to give somebody feedback, for example, to say you're disorganized and not to give them 10 ideas about, about how to be organized. So I made it as a survey and also as a coaching tool. Good, good. Um, the, the problems that Torchmetrics solves for presenters um, who, who want to improve, let's, let's walk through just a couple of them. Yeah. Well, one would be that the disorganization piece, what happens is there's a whole section on executive summaries and how to make an executive summary. There are PowerPoint slides to help someone organize it. Then a person knows what to do because you can't just say to somebody, you're disorganized. You know, you have to tell them what to do about it. The other problem is that Sometimes, many times, someone will present and people will say, good job. But in reality, they don't really think so, but they don't know what to tell the person. You know, was it not good because they looked in the ceiling? Was it not good because they awed oh, all the time? What didn't make it not so good? So Torch Metrics gives enough specific feedback that the presenter knows where their problems are. Got it. Now, in your experience, how do presenters really improve? Uh, you know, just for me, like, like dancing, or they practice a lot and just get in time, you know, feedback over and over again. How, how, how is this best brought out? 
You know, the real secret for me is the video. If, if I, let's say I'm working with somebody and I can say to them, let's say, I can say you sway all the time, but they don't feel it and know it. Once I video them and they see it, I don't have to say anything. They see the problem. And I find if, you, if I video people or when I do, they get better quicker. Uh, the big one is ums, right? So people will talk uh, um, and uh, um. They don't even know they do it. And once they see themselves, they fix the problem. Exactly. All right, Claudine, it's been a pleasure having you on the show. Thank you for being our guest today. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. You've been watching CEO Money with Michael Yorba. Thanks for joining us. Don't forget, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.